Now, a special charity walk begins tomorrow, starting at Older Hay in Merseyside and making its way 40 miles to Old Trafford Football Ground in Manchester, of course. The aim is to raise £10,000 for the Children's Hospital, which is treating the young cousin of the person making that trek. And what makes this challenge so special is that the person who joins us live on the sofa, it's all very important because of him, it is seven-year-old Harvey and his mum, Naomi. <laughs> <laughs> Naomi, uh, Harvey rather, just tell us exactly what you're going to be doing tomorrow. I'm going to be doing a really big walk to Old Hay to Old Trafford. Yes, and why are you ending at Old Trafford? Because it's my favourite team and it's it's the best team in the world. Well done. And you had a little hiccup. We know you've got hiccups, don't we? So <laughs> hold your breath while I, I give your mum a question. <laughs> now, listen, you must be really proud. And this is to raise money for Older Hay because Harvey's cousin, Zach, yep. who's eight, is being treated there. How is Zach at the moment? Zach is he's doing well. He's really strong and he's a real fighter. You know, he's been there for quite a while and, you know, he's, he's, doing, he's doing good. Yeah. And what made you come up with this idea to do the walk? Because I heard a story first of Zach being sick mm. and having cancer. So I decided to do another walk to Old Hay to Old Trafford. Because mm. you've already done a pretty big walk already, haven't you? Yes. That was for your school? Yeah. And, and so what did that involve? Where did you walk then? I just walked to Old Trafford. From walked your to... primary school? From... From your primary school and where's yeah. your primary school? It's, it's Stockton Heath. Right, so it's still a fair walk and how much did you raise then? I raised over eight and a half pounds. Eight and a half eight thousand. Thousand, thousand pounds, yeah. And this time you're hoping to raise Ten thousand pounds. Yes. Ten thousand. Yes. And are you doing this walk on your own tomorrow? No, I'm doing it with my friends, my family, my head teacher, and a famous legend, United player, Sammy McElroy. Sammy McElroy. <laughs> now he is a legend, isn't he? And a great guy as well. And also, Naomi, you're going to have lots of support. Lots of support, yes. Yeah. So I think there's around 100 people doing the walk in total from oh, start to great. finish with lots of little surprises along the way, of friends and family joining on. Oh, fantastic. And then when you get to Old Trafford, even more support, I'd imagine. Yeah, I think around four or 500 people at Old Trafford for a big finish line to oh, so, uh, see the champion in. And you want to raise 10,000, but you wouldn't ra mind raising a bit more. But yeah. how much have we raised so far, Harvey? We've raised 16... I mean, 17,000. Oh, right, 17, so you've already bust your target. 500, yes. And yeah. perhaps after tonight, you might get even more, do you think? Yes. How much would you like to raise, Harvey? I would like to raise 20,000 pounds. Well, <laughs> aim high. You, I have no doubt that you will. This is absolutely amazing. Now, how much um, training have you had to do for this walk? So I have to, to do lots of training. Yeah. Have you? What have you been doing? Yeah. I've been doing wrestling, kickboxing, uh, running and lots of walking. So you're really fit? Yes. This is going to be quite easy for you, isn't it? Yeah. And what about your five-year-old sister? Uh, she's going to be OK. She's going to be in the pram a little bit. Is she? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. she's going to take it a little bit easy. Yeah. Well, I think... Um, you're going to be walking Saturday, Sunday, so we probably ought to know what the weather's going to be like because we're yes. going to hope for some good weather, aren't we? Yeah. OK, well, the lady behind you now. OK, hello. Can, can I feel you... like there's a lot of pressure on me. <laughs> yeah, it is. Come on, tell us that Harvey's got some good weather. It's going to absolutely chuck it down. Oh, no, I'm just no. kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. April Fool. It is an April Fool. <laughs> 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 it's actually an improving story for the weekend. So perfect conditions, especially on Sunday for Harvey's big walk. Now, it was a bit of a damp start to the day uh, this morning in Congleton. Thanks to Leslie for sending this picture in. Damp, actually, we've had the provisional stats in from the Met Office. It's been the wettest March since 1981. And the rain that we've seen through today in the past couple of days is all thanks to this area of low pressure. It's going to continue to push away to Germany. And once that does, yeah, tomorrow we will be a bit damp in places, but high pressure will start to build. So we're going to end the weekend with plenty of sunshine, light winds, and it should feel really quite pleasant for that walk. Over through this evening, we are still holding on to a few patches of rain and drizzle out and about. A lot of us, though, will become dry. And as we go overnight tonight, we're going to start to see a few breaks in the cloud. But it's not going to result in a frost. Temperatures still hover around six or seven degrees. The breeze will be fairly light from the northeast. 
So starting off the weekend in the Isle of Man, we are going to see a fair amount of cloud first thing. You could get the odd spot of rain and drizzle from it, but on the whole, it should be mostly dry here. Elsewhere, the best of the sunshine, actually, good news for Harvey, is in Manchester, Great Manchester, Merseyside. Into the afternoon, we're going to start to see clouds spilling in from the east. Now, for Trans-Pennine routes, you could well get some poor visibility and some outbreaks of rain and drizzle as well. Temperatures, we're looking at around 10 to 12 degrees. Now, as we go then through into Sunday, you can see beautiful clear blue skies. And in fact, it's not going to be until Tuesday that we start to see clouds coming in. The winds will veer southwesterly, and that is going to introduce more in the way of cloud and outbreaks of rain through Tuesday onwards. But for Sunday, beautiful, plenty of sunshine, dry and fine. It should feel quite pleasant with temperatures climbing up to around about 13 degrees. So all in all, really pleasant, perfect in fact for Harvey to do his walk. <laughs> Thank you, you're welcome. They sort of went good when we heard about the weather on Sunday. <laughs> It's going to be a good walk. And it's going to be weather. absolutely beautiful. Yeah. So you're very excited? Yes. Yes? And what are you going to do when you get to the finish point? I'm I going to... About you. Yeah, I'm going to run to the finish line with all my friends chasing me and stuff. <laughs> Have you got, you like, you know when you score a goal and you do that big, woo! Yeah. What well, can you do it for us? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> are you going to be wearing your Manchester United top underneath your older Hay T-shirt? Maybe. Maybe, yes. And... You're going to have to have an early night tonight, aren't you? Yes. Yeah? And don't forget snacks. Any pockets you've got, get those chocolate bars in. Yes. Some pockets yeah. right here. You need that. You've, you've got, got to keep going. Pockets. Some energy drinks. Yeah. yeah, and I hope your hiccups have left you by then. I'm sure they will. <laughs> Good luck, both of you. Thank you. I think it'll Thank go you. really, really well. And well done for doing what you're doing as well for Older Thank Hay. You. Well done. Uh, isn't he brilliant? Thank you very much for watching. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.